With us now, Dr. Drew Pinsky, chief medical board member, known for his self-titled television show, Dr. Drew. All right, lots to unpack here. The White House today uh, admitted that the president talked to a neurologist uh, three times during his medical exams, won't say why. Uh, one of the top Parkinson's do docs in the country uh, has come to the White House at least eight times, won't say, uh, in fact, won't even uh, acknowledge publicly this person's name who was a visitor um, at the White House. If the White House isn't going to start talking about the president's medical conditions honestly, is it fair now for doctors to start speculating about it? You know, uh, it's never fair to speculate about the diagnosis, but we are certainly at our liberty to describe what we see. Let me just say that when doctors are trained in medical school, we are shown images, pictures, say, of rashes, so we learn what rashes are when we see them out in the clinic. And when it comes to neurological diseases, we watch videos, videos of people with things like movement disorders, and a video that would be exemplary of movement disorder would be watching Joe Biden walk, watching his arm swing, watching his facial lack of facial expression. These are a constellation of symptoms that are called Parkinsonian. Now, whether he has Parkinson's disease or not, that's what's not fair. No one should be speculating on what his diagnosis is. We don't know. A lot of things cause Parkinsonian features. But it is completely reasonable to say we are seeing motoric slowing, festinating gait, masked faces, slow speech. Let me just tell you what speech the Parkinson's Foundation says a Parkinsonian speech is. Stuttering, mumbling, slurring words, using monotone, speaking softly, having trouble projecting voice. This is all a Parkinson's. So he's got multiple. The only thing he doesn't have is tremor that we can see at least. So this is simply a fact. I'm just describing okay. what we are seeing, which are Parkinsonian features. Now, we can speculate. The one thing that happens to a doctor when he or she sees a list of these observable findings, we start thinking, well, what are the kinds of things that could cause those? I could give you that list. I can't tell you which one applies to him. None of them are particularly reassuring. Thanks for watching. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.